Steritite assembly for use. Recommended inspection criteria. Verify that gaskets in the lid and in the filter retention plate or plates are pliable without cracks or tears and that they are all properly and firmly affixed. If the retention plate is loose, adjust the tension by pressing downward along the perimeter of the plate. Verify that the filter retention post or posts in the lid and label holders on the front of the Steritite container are secure. The recommended inspection criteria should be performed after each use because of the variables associated with cleaning agents and equipment. For Steritite perforated bottom container, place a circular filter over the perforations in the base of the Steritite container and place the filter retention plate over the filter. Secure the filter retention plate by pushing downwards at center point where indicated and rotate the handle counterclockwise to close. Arrange the clean instruments in the basket or baskets according to hospital procedures following the recommendations provided by the instrument manufacturer. Meta tray partitions, brackets and posts are recommended for easy loading and unloading as well as protection of your delicate instruments. Place the prepared baskets into the base of the Steritite container. Place a chemical indicator in the corner of the instrument basket. Place a circular filter over the perforations in the lid of the Steritite container and place the filter retention plate over the filter. Secure the filter retention plate by pushing downwards at center point, where indicated, and rotate the handle counterclockwise to close. Please note, use SCF01 cellulosic filter for steam sterilization. Use SCF02 polypropylene filter for sterad sterilization. Place the lid on the top of the base. Secure the closure by latching the lid to the base. The top of the latch fits over the ridge in the lid. Push the bottom section of the latch over the lock holder. You will feel a solid click. Place the appropriate metal ID tags in the label holders located to either side of the container latches. The label holder on the right can accommodate a load card available from Case Medical Incorporated. Thread the guide on the Steritite Tamper Evidence Seal through the lock holder and secure. Repeat on both latches. An external indicator should be attached to the container at this time. Place the Steritite container flat on the shelf of the sterilizer cart. If needed, up to three containers may be stacked and processed in an autoclave. Consult the recommendations of your sterilizer manufacturer in order to determine the correct parameters regarding temperature, weight load, dry time, instrument processing, and pre- and post-conditioning cycles. Caution! Use of the Steritite container in gravity displacement steam may increase exposure time. Following the sterilization process, the cart should be removed from the sterilizer and placed in cool down for a minimum of 20 minutes to minimize the potential of condensate formation within the container.